Your pinpoint weather forecast with meteorologist Jason Livia. Well, the rain that we've been seeing today is finally winding down. If we take a look at our radar and satellite right now, most of the rain has moved off to our east, but we are still seeing some final remnants of the system move through the Mid-Ohio Valley. Just a couple showers here or there, but then behind that you can see the clouds are already starting to break. So by the time that we all wake up tomorrow morning, those clouds should be mostly, if not all, gone. Rain totals for the entire day are pretty good. We're sitting at about an average accumulation of about just under an inch, but some of these green areas here are uh, isolated locations that have hit or have estimated to hit just over an inch of rain. So that'll help a lot with our drought. But going into the future cast, it's going to clear up pretty quickly as we head into the rest of the night tonight and into tomorrow morning. By 8 a.m., most of the clouds should be completely gone. And then that'll continue to be the case for most of the week. And then Wednesday, we'll start seeing clouds return for another possible chance of rain overnight Wednesday into Thursday. But going into this evening, it's about 62 degrees looking out from the Jandil Sky Cam in Marietta with the wind from the southwest at about five miles an hour. Temperatures around the region in those mid 60s, excuse me, low 60s, pretty much across the entire area. Very little deviation, 60 in Elizabeth and then the warmest being 63 in Marietta and a couple other places as well. Going into the rest of tonight, we'll cool back down into the low 50s. Some spots may see the upper 40s and those clouds will start to decrease as well. Going into tomorrow, temperature wise, it's going to feel very similar in the mid to upper 50s. Some spots may see the low 60s. I have our high here in the central mid Ohio Valley at around 60 degrees. Going into the rest of the week, it's going to be a cold one, especially on Tuesday when a series of cold fronts comes through, keeping our temperatures very cold. We may see below freezing Tuesday night, but then we will balance out into the mid to upper 50s, low 60s, much better than we've seen seeing for the last several weeks. That'll do it for weather. Back to you, Haley.